This is a topic for Canadian TV. What has happened to the mindset of most people today? Have you ever encountered humans who are disrespectful, jealous, mean, self-centered, untrustworthy, or valid? These are the complete opposites of the Creator's original design. He didn't create us to be this way. It has been referred to as generational sin. It's been going on for centuries. People all over this globe, and this includes Americans, have been raised to think they alone have arrived to their era because of who they think they are in society. If they don't fit the mold of who's who in society, they tend to wreak havoc all over this land with unpleasant deeds forcing anyone's demise. Children are being raised up with fanfare or methods of corruption and disorder are being passed down but no biblical knowledge. These traits pass down to the daughters and sons. The apple doesn't trough, fall far from the trees, the elders used to say. We are not only slacking, we're lacking. The elders used to say that too. Raising children to think their waste doesn't stink and whatever they want is theirs or they can do anything legally or illegally, whatever, and you will always take their side is a designing plan for them to grow up with a superior attitude. When they become old enough to understand how they can crush others with their attitude or when they become adults, they often persecute others who are perceived, let me turn the page real quick, to be beneath them. The perfect targets are people who seem to be struggling in life or someone who doesn't live up to their expectations. Usually people like this run in packs like hungry wolves. If your spirit is gentle, or is it soon that you are weak if you're not careful you would be consumed by association. The people who kick it with them have the same traits or they want to be popular, so they're willing to pay any price to fit in. If you kick it with them, the moment you go against the grain, you will be eliminated from the group and you will become the new target. The spirits of their role models are usually vain, vicious, or vocal. It is normal for these spirits to have a combination of all three. Hmm. The simple speak fix, the simple fix to a bad attitude is to get closer to God by reading and living by the good book and have a life and live a life according to his purpose. Almost no one does this anymore. So we have bratty, defiant, ungrateful, unruly, violent children and parents who have lost their vision. In the beginning of my career around the city, teamwork was expected and clicks were a bit on the down low. In 30 years, I have noticed that people have changed and the wisdom that the Bible holds have become mist and watercolored until we get back into church and practice daily what the real book says to do, change the mindsets of our children, it's downhill from this point. One day, someone like the Donald would be president and the end of times would be closer than we ever dreamed. I'm done preaching and I'm not a preacher, really. I'm just a vessel. Have a good day, everyone.